Feeling down because you're feeling ordinary? Well, hold your horses, because it turns out there's nothing wrong with being average looking. Like it or not, our physical appearances matter a great deal in how we perceive each other. There are those whom society has deemed to be good looking, and so we're bombarded with their images everywhere. However, the majority of us, by definition, are deemed average. But while it may not have the best ring to it, is being average really such a bad thing? If you're on the internet, it's easy to think that's the case. With adults of all ages turning to cosmetic procedures to meet an ever-changing standard of beauty. And truth be told, there is some merit to this idea. People who are deemed as attractive tend to be treated better by strangers and have an easier time landing jobs. This is what is sometimes known as pretty privilege. Oh, but while there's no denying these benefits exist for the ridiculously good-looking folks of the world, it's not such a bad thing to stand outside that category. In fact, some research shows that being labeled as average-looking may actually have some legitimate advantages to it. Many of us have heard the expression easy on the eyes when describing someone who is considered exceptionally beautiful. But there's another side to that coin, easy on the brain. And in that category, average-looking faces win tenfold. In fact, per the findings in a 2014 study conducted at the University of Texas, people process average-looking faces at a much faster rate than they do unattractive or beautiful faces. This partially explains why, when people are asked to rank others based on attractiveness, they tend to favor those who are more typical-looking. Researchers believe that, because ordinary faces are easier for the brain to interpret, they cause people to feel positive emotions when looking at them. Other research supports this hypothesis. A 2016 study published in the Royal Society Publishing found that men consistently rank women with simple-looking faces as the most attractive. Some experts have suggested these preferences may be consistent across gender. And indeed it is. In 2018, Oxford University's Internet Institute teamed up with eHarmony to analyze dating app messaging practices. The research found that heterosexual women were more likely to message an average-looking man than one who might consider themselves a 10 on a scale of looks. It's possible there's an evolutionary explanation for all of this, too. According to a 2011 study published in Philosophical Transactions B, those with average physical looks tend to have more diverse genes, something that has long been viewed as essential to breeding strong, healthy offspring. What all that boils down to is that, when it comes to choosing a mate, average looks make someone something of a hot commodity. According to a 2014 study published in Psychological Science, when we first meet someone, we subconsciously evaluate their face for signs of trustworthiness. And although the movies we watch present us with heroes who look like supermodels, research shows that, in real life, we're more likely to trust someone with a more normal face. That is America's ass. Why is this? Well, psychologists hypothesize that it has to do with something called the mere exposure effect. As psychologist Anthony Little tells Vice, we do like what is familiar. For example, the more times you hear a piece of music, the more positive you feel towards it. The same is true of abstract art. More familiarity means increased liking. The same applies to face recognition. When we see someone who reminds us of an old friend or neighbor, we feel more at ease than we are when faced with something foreign to our senses. This also explains why humans can be drawn to those who look similar to their parents, or to other people with whom they've had good experiences and relationships. Conversely, our feelings change when we come across someone with features we aren't used to seeing. Psychological scientist Dr. Carmel Sofer explains to Duffer and Research, As people's faces get more distinctive, irrespective of whether it is more or less attractive, it gets less trustworthy. So, next time a bit of AI software deems your looks as average, try not to view it as an insult. If you're typical, it means your presence probably puts people at ease. And that's something worth celebrating.